What's going on guys, King Trats here, back another video on the channel. And today we are back with another episode of the highest rated, highest rated Korean fried chicken in my area. I am so excited about this because it's wafting into my large nostrils and I can smell how good it smells. We went to a place called Lawrence Chicken. It's also known as Lawrence Chicken Burger, depending on where you look. On DoorDash, it had a 5.0 rating. It's about 30 ratings. It also had a 5.0 on Uber Eats and on Google, 4.6 out of 25 ratings. Now, if this is as correct as I think I am, it is actually a franchise because there's another location in Fort Lee. So I think the Carlstadt version is relatively new because it just popped up on my DoorDash. And when I looked, the food looked absolutely unreal. So I've got about there's one of them isn't chicken, but I think I can get one, two, three, four orders, I can't count, of different flavors of fried chicken, and I'm just, I'm not gonna hold y'all, because I can smell, one of them is like garlic, because I can, and I, garlic is just one of my things. You feel these nostrils are starting to flare. I'm gonna start off with the OG, this is the golden, this is nice, because they have my name, as well as the flavor going on here. And I haven't seen any of these yet. <laughs> All I've done is smell them. So, let's go. Oui, oui, who's ready? Who's ready? Just come right here. Make it look nice. Pop you on top. Here. I love the little red and white. I don't know why. It just makes me feel like the food's gonna be even better. But you think I'm not gonna eat that? You are out of your damn mind. You know I clean my table, so that's fine. So we're gonna start right with that one. Got the drum. Let me see the test. Oh yeah, yeah, this is finna. I'm eating it. I don't care. We don't waste food. What do they do? What am I tasting? At first, I was like, I'm not sure. And then it started to just like hit me. There's, there's, and then I saw on the description, like Colonel Sanders got about 11 blends of herbs and spices, 11. They got 21. And I'm starting to get all 21 the more I bite into it. This got some soul to it, bro. That can kind of be a pun. Soul is the capital of South Korea, but I meant the other soul. That's so good. It's like it has depth because you bite it at first and you're like, okay, nice crust. And then all of a sudden you start getting like a symphony. It's even got a little bit of like undertone of spice to it. And they gave me three out of four drums too. Dub. Like, kind of peppery, but a little bit of spice to it. Not very salty, which I like. I don't like really salty food. It's got just enough. But honestly, I'm interested to know what the hell the spice blend is. Y'all can just mail that to me. We have some fun. The more I bite this, the more I want it. Super juicy. Hmm. <clears throat> And this is just the original? Oh yeah. I'm sorry, I almost bit the whole thing. <laughs> the gristle part, I almost bit the whole thing on. Listen, I know we're in a wing shortage and I shouldn't be doing this, but somebody gotta eat this, right? Damn, 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 damn. Okay, flats just for y'all. No, I don't like the flats, but listen. Can y'all see like the, look at that. I can't do it justice. These are just some really good fried chicken. It is. So, I could have just gotten the OG and been fine with it. Mm. Even the chicken tastes good, like the actual, listen, listen. Listen. You know, I'm biting the whole, I'm biting the cartilage everything. 
if this is just the opening salvo, the first round, I'm about to start making all kinds of funny noises when I get into these flavors. So let's do it. Okay, we're gonna take it right down the line. Next is usually my favorite flavor of wing at any place that I order wings from. If you're new to the channel, you're gonna find that out very quickly because I eat, do eat a lot of wings. Oh, lemon pepper. Love me some lemon pepper. I'm trying not to rip the box, but they making this real hard on me. I'm just gonna take the whole thing out. Do this, do this. Oh yeah, we. You can see the damn lemon pepper on these. Look at this. Look, it's not like crystallization of the, y'all see that? This bite right here, don't you see that little, this? Oh my goodness. There's sugar on this. You can see it and you can taste it. That's different in a good way. Are you real lemon zest on this? Oh, y'all gonna get fancy? Okay. All right. All right. My goodness. My goodness. That's <clears throat> that one's even more got the dusting on it, and the flavor is just super bold, man. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. I gotta show this again one more time. Look at the amount of seasoning. Look at that. Like you can see it. And when I tell you the flavor is nice and bold and different. And the chicken is super juicy. And it's got a good balance. Like, yeah, I get the lemon, but I just drop it. Damn. Like I was saying. Yes, I get the lemon, but it's not like overpowering. Like this actually tastes like lemon pepper. And then, like I said, it's almost like the sugar, it's like a sweetness to it too. So it balances out the really like the citrus, which some sweet. And the chicken itself, it's like super juicy. Did y'all see the seasonings that fall out there? Did y'all see? I, that's not, I'm like, I'm making this up. Yeah, we gonna have to just, I'm gonna one bite this one. Somebody gonna make a nasty comment about that. I don't care. Y'all won't get happy watching me anyway. I mean, happy, happy. It's good. Cause I'm enjoying it just as much as you. That is, pfft. man, that's a good one. I wonder if these are gonna keep getting better as I eat them. Because every time I bite one, I just want more. Ah, that's so good. Part three. I got like some lemon pepper seasoning that's chilling on the top of this and I actually wanna just like eat it. <laughs> but I'm not gonna. Cause that'd be a little too much, even for me. The next flavor. This one just straight up says Korean. So this is probably the, the, the that sweet, sticky kind of one that I remember. Yes, it is. Oh, I'm ready for this. I'm ready for this. Oh, that smells. I get garlic. So, oh, I love me some garlic too. This is about to be some fun. I can't. I'm gonna pluck them. Whatever. Don't even matter. We ain't here to be cute. Oh yeah, I can. I can feel the stick. The sticky. Y'all are nasty. Stop making nasty comments in y'all head chunks of garlic look at that look at this look at this oh my goodness the anticipation right now
sweet, garlicky. Not spicy. Like sticky wings though. I love me sticky wings. Look at this. Just look at the look at the like the I don't even know what you want to call that. Just call it that. Just look at whatever it is. This might be a one biter. Can I get it? No, I can't get a grip on this one. Oh my goodness. I can't say this enough. These might be some of the most juiciest wings I've had. Like, ever. And I've eaten a lot of freaking wings in my life. But, I don't know if it's because of the way they brined them or, or what, but the wings are just super juicy. Like, they're inside, moist. Like, I know some people hate that word, but I don't care. Like, what kind of some describe it? Mm, absolutely love them. Man. These are crazy addictive. And I love the fact that you can get them, like, in fours like this, so I can just, like, sample them. Cause I've run through. Listen, I, I can't stress it enough. Just look at how moist the inside of that is. Can y'all see that? And that sticky sauce, garlicky, unbelievable good. Oh my god, I'd be 450 pounds if I was anywhere near this place all the time. That's addictively good. This is as good as it gets. Everything about it. We got one more flavor and some dessert, and I'm, ugh, you can't top this, it's impossible. Okay, one more. These um, are supposedly spicy there. They're volcano wings. Let me see, I just, I like it in a whiff when I open it. It's interesting. Let's see what we got. I like this unveiling like this, right, isn't it? A little crooked, but then we move. Yeah, I can definitely smell it. It's like a little spicier. Much darker of a red, but very similar to the last Korean ones. Right down, biting the freaking top part. Did y'all see my body just like do one of these? I don't even know what that was. I felt it. I felt it. You know I'm eating this shit. I don't care. Is this love? Is this what love feels like? Y'all see I'm just looking at it. I'm like, dang, you did your thing. Listen. I don't know who Lauren is. Right? Are you single? This is my favorite one. It's got that same sticky, little bit of sweet, little bit of garlic that the last ones had. But, spicy. <laughs> Now, I like my wings with a little heat to them. My, my, my lips are starting to tingle a little bit. You see, I'm trying to nibble little pieces off of here. You know, this one's a one biter. All right. Mm -hmm. Mm 
That's phenomenal. I love the heat this one brings. And look at the size of this wing. Look at the flavor on that. Just look at it. Look at that. Y'all want some? Here. Fantastic. There's still like three flavors I didn't get either. And their chicken sandwiches look mad good, but I only got one stomach. I'm not trying to get 97 items. I'll be here all day talking to me. Unless I want to. Mm. Seriously, the chicken. Just the chicken. My people here got this down to a science. I know this is like an unorthodox way they probably do it. Probably get their own system, whatever it is. There ain't no way they're just grabbing chicken bread and frying some sauce on it. There's something they're doing. Because, you know I've eaten a lot of fried chicken in my life. On camera, off camera, whatever. But the chicken, again, I cannot stress enough how like moist it actually is. Now, an order of four is six and change. Taco Bell's wings, you get an order of six for $6. You can take two wings away for make them taste like that. You know what I'm saying? So, fairly priced. I love the four thing. You can just like mix and match, and you can do half and half. Uh, they had sandwiches. They had a couple of other things. I'm gonna try this dessert, but this place is a massive W. Original plan was not to get any dessert, but when I was looking towards the end of the menu, I saw they had this, and I'd never seen this before. Apparently, it's a thing, so I Googled it. I don't know if you can read this handwriting. I don't want to mess this up, but this right here is a croffle. Um, if you're guessing what a croffle is, you're probably right. It is a croissant that they waffle ironed. And it looks like, let's see what we got. Huh? Oui. Look at this. It's like powdered sugar to croissant croffle. Never heard of no croffle. But no, I want the powdered sugar bite. This is the bite right here. <laughs> that's good you taste that buttery flavor croissant it literally tastes like a croissant you add the crispness they add to it from putting it inside the waffle arm that's so simple and so good again if you look at the cross section you can see like it's definitely just like a regular croissant I happen to really like them, and I'm not gonna cross home because I'm not French, okay? Croissant, leave me alone. Mmm, airy. Mmm, I should just made waffles out of croissant. Croissant. Mmm, s'il vous plaît. Um, and then you add that powdered sugar to it, just adds a little bit of extra to it. But the texture on this thing, this is money. Uh, how much does it cost? More croissant. Like 250. I don't even heard of this place. First time I heard of this place was about three hours ago. Dub. Dub. Korean fried chicken in general. Every single time I've had it, it's just been so good. You know, they have a different way of doing it than the, the way that I grew up eating it. And of course, I love the way that I grew up eating it. But it just provides like a different kind of vibe. The texture, the crunch to it. Adding like the garlic, soy, sticky, sweet, spicy all of that to it the brushing that they do a lot of times they brush it fantastic this place was a slam dunk slam dunk slam dunk um i can see why people gave it you know 5.0s 4.9s i'm right in the same ballpark if you haven't seen it there's another one in fort lee i'm definitely gonna go back i'm gonna try the chicken burger um which leads me to leave maybe like they're australian or something like that because we don't call it that we call it chicken sandwiches but master w i highly recommend it Definitely see why I'm eating that. You know, something. It's the highest rated. Please got to said it's something. It is something. I can see why it's one of the highest rated around. Delicious. I, I, I'm I standing by it. Said what I said. We'll be back, though, tomorrow. Oh, man. More content. I love y'all. The hand signs. They made it to YouTube.